working with Max, yes. what was that like for you? Max is um, such an incredible director, and you can see it's in his blood, obviously. He worked on this film for 12 years of his life. It's kind of, um, it was just so amazing seeing him. He doesn't feel like a first time director. He was so planned out in his mind, and you can see this. And he also, he's a very, he's like a pop is like, he really? Yes, he loves pop music. I'm gonna tell him that he's you like said a, that. Yeah, you could say it, <laughs> and I think he would say it about himself probably, but it's like he loves pop music. Like, he's really obsessed with that world, so perfect yeah. film that he made. Well, we saw lots yeah. of photos of you guys before we knew you were working together. Yeah. Was it weird to hear about all that, like, dating speculation uh, between the two of you? You know, I mean, we just really love working together. Elle Fanning and addressing those Max Mangella romance rumors. And that was, like, very special, and he's such a good friend, yeah. you know, that I, um, I'll i do any other movie that he wants me to do. So his second, um, whatever, yeah. Max makes his directorial debut with Teen Spirit, while Elle stars in the flick. I keep dancing on my own. What made Elle the perfect actress to really carry this? I think movie. she's the only actress who could have carried it, and I mean, that's not being hyperbolic. It's It's... It's an incredible list of requirements. You have to be able to sing, you've got to be able to dance, you've got to be able to, you know, speak Polish convincingly, do the British accent, play the age range, and carry a movie with an incredibly nuanced performance. And uh, uh, she just handled everything with such kind of discipline mm -hmm. and professionalism. And she did all of her singing live. Yeah. It's amazing. It's an amazing piece of work. I'm giving it my Funny, I was just talking to Elle and she called you a pop whore. I love pop music. I, yeah. I listened to Dancing on My Own when, right, right when it came out, that Robin so song, and I love that song. The movie now, when I see the film, it all feels like it has a very specific tone that comes out of that, yeah. that particular song. I mean, I've been introduced to so many uh, like pop artists through Max. I've been over at his house and been like, what are you listening to? We would like to offer Violet a contract. Elle plays Violet, a Polish student who enters a singing competition show. He's not a real manager or anything, but he has a lot for me. The actress trained with several vocal coaches and choreographers for three months. There's a lot of people like involved to get me yeah. to a place. I dance growing up. I did a lot of ballet and I love to dance, but mm -hmm. just showing, having that in a film and was something very new to me. You're an inexperienced performer with a Polish name. Talk about learning to speak Polish. Yeah. <laughs> was it difficult? Yes. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> it was. I, um, you know, it's Polish is also not a language that I hear exactly. every day. So I think when it's something that's completely just, whoa, like that is just completely new to me. And also I, he, you know, would do it phonetically. So I would be just kind of the sounds of it, making sure that each line is, um, is properly said. When I'm alone. Do you want to pursue a singing career? You know, I would. You know, I really? actually would. I who knows? Like not like oh a career. I don't know. I would never. I would still yeah. act and um, would love to. To I mean, obviously, still act and that's my my thing. But it's cool. Like it opened the door to that, and I would never say no to. Maybe, you know, who knows? Yeah. Maybe I would, but I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I really enjoyed it. Like, I really enjoyed it.